guys, welcome back to my channel. I feel like I should do the British way. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, if you guys couldn't tell from the title, I guess I should say I hope you're having a fantastic day. And I'm here today with my friend Cheryl, who's British. Do you want to tell the story of how we met? Basically through YouTube, <laughs> um, but I was the first person to ever recognize Sarah yeah. in public, I guess, mm -hmm. at Summer in the City. I kind of ran up to her and was like, you're Sarah, right? And she was like, yeah, who are you, you weird English no, girl? No, no. <laughs> Come on, I was no, nice. No, Come she on, was give really me some. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, but a little bit surprised. Yeah, I was but... totally surprised. Yeah, yeah, so that was like about almost a year ago. Yeah, and, we had um, about 4,000, 5,000 5, subscribers at the time. Yeah, so you were definitely the first person <laughs> yeah. that ever recognized me. And I was just like, hi, I didn't really know how to react. I still I still never know how to react, but it is. it was really nice. I was super duper flattered. And, you know, here we are, we both happen to be in Amsterdam for VidCon and I thought you guys love our cultural differences videos and it's always Switzerland but since Cheryl is British do you say British or do you say English English okay mm. she's English we are gonna do like a pronunciation test challenge mm -hmm. type of thing. I think it's gonna be funny yeah. yeah so we're gonna we have a list of words and I guess apparently they're pronounced super different in US versus UK, so we're just gonna go down the list. We're gonna each just say it how we would say it. And you guys, I should mention, Cheryl, you started your own channel, didn't you? Yeah, a couple of months what ago. What do you talk about on it? Why don't you um, tell me? I guess I kind of talk about expat life. That's kind of my main focus and a thing that I think is my unique yeah. thing. But I mean, I talk a little bit about minimalism and some other like interests that I have, but mainly it's kind of my life between London and Paris, because I live in Paris. How cool does that sound, you guys? You should definitely go check it out. I'll link it up here and I'll link it in the description. So go show some love to Cheryl, my lovely, like, just subscriber turned friend. And yeah, I was just, you know, I was just talking about not having many friends and how YouTube is a great way to meet people. Definitely, so things yeah. like this happening, it just makes my, my heart, like, so, so <laughs> happy. But let's get into the language challenge test. So how would you pronounce that first word? Basel. Okay, I would say... Basil or basil would be like really um, Midwesterner, so okay, we disagree on that one. Okay, next word, I would say that herb. Herb. Okay. <laughs> That's more of a huh. Okay, yeah. Herb. <laughs> okay, next one. Okay, you go first. Tomato. Toma tomato, of course. Tomato. tomato. Does that sound so cringe to you? Is it just like... No, it's just, you know, different accents. It's not... <laughs> and you hear it all the time anyway because I watch American films and... That's true. They're American people, so... Okay, let's go to this one. I can't... I Like, this word next, I can't imagine how else it could possibly be pronounced, so... Tuna. Tuna. Yeah, it is No, but same. mine's more of a tuna. Tuna. You put like a C-H in yeah, it. Yeah. Tuna. Okay, tuna. Yeah, okay, okay. Okay, next word, I would pronounce that fertile. 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 You actually say all the letters. Like, you're probably saying it how it's actually supposed to be said, if I had to guess. <laughs> next one. Ballet. Ballet. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> well, no one's gonna say ballet, are they? Ballet. <laughs> that, would be, that would be really embarrassing. <laughs> Okay, I actually know, okay, this word, I'm going to say, I know how she's going to say it. She's going to say, laboratory. Laboratory. <laughs> oh no, I was totally wrong. <laughs> Who did I pronounce that like in well, Australia or something? <laughs> yeah, face palm. Yeah, I would say laboratory. Yeah, we kind of like smush the middle syllable. Laboratory. Mm, laboratory. Who says laboratory? Am I just making that up? Okay, next word, I would pronounce garage. Garage. Oh, that one is totally different. Ga okay, we should like make each other say it the other way. Yeah. So, garage. Garage. <laughs> it's not really that hard. Like, bathroom. 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 A lot of people will say bathroom, but for some reason I say bathroom. Bathroom. But. And but I think you know, obviously in the U.S., if you're in a restaurant, you say where is the bathroom, but you don't say that in England. They say where's the toilet? Where's the toilet? Yeah. yeah. And I think I tend to say that now because in German and like in, I think in most languages they mm. say where is the toilet, and then for some reason in, in the U.S. we say it's kind of euphemized. Yeah. Bit, yeah. <laughs> yeah. So we say because no one's gonna go take a bath. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> so yeah. I just said bath, but I say bathroom. Bath. Yeah. It's so weird. That is weird. I think if you would say in the U.S. like where's the toilet, <laughs> like I'll be honest, it sounds like you're super desperate, like you have to go to the to the toilet like right now, like. <laughs> 
<laughs> like something bad is about to happen. Where's the toilet? Not the bathroom, like the, the toilet itself. It sounds a little bit crude, I think, to, to if you would say quite that in direct. American. Yeah, quite direct, exactly. Or I think um, WC, do you use that in um, England? In France, I do, but In not. France, yeah. yeah. Which is funny because people say it stands for water closet. Yeah. And they use it in Germany, but it's. It's English, so it's kind yeah. of weird. Oh, okay. I'm gonna let's do this again. I'm gonna guess how Cheryl is gonna pronounce this word. I think she's gonna say advertisement. Mm, advertisement. <laughs> really? But I think I don't know. What kind I, of pronunciation am I am I thinking? Advert. I don't know because I think sometimes I might say advertisement and sometimes. Mm. Mm. Advertisement. <laughs> I'm just kidding. Adver advertisement. Advertisement. Yeah. Definitely depends where you're from in the US, how you say some of these words. Definitely. Mm -hmm. Okay, this one. You go ahead. Can't. Can't. <laughs> can't. Yeah, we definitely can't. Can't. Would this be premiere? Premiere? <laughs> premiere. Prime. Prime. Oh, I like roll my R. What am I doing? <laughs> well, wait, wait, say it again. Premiere. Prime. Premier. <laughs> I'm like, I don't know, I'm like saying it in a totally... Premier. Premier. <laughs> you, you sound French. I sound <laughs> French. I'm like, I'm making it up as I go. It, Next, I would say... I don't even know what that word yeah, is. Yeah, <laughs> My, I think it's minute. Oh. I know, I know, I, I, I know how you're going to say it. I've seen this in the movies. Aluminium. Aluminium. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Aluminum. We say aluminum. 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 <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay, you're pretty good at that. Okay. Yeah. Again. Okay. How would how would I pronounce this word? Ant. Ant. Like a crawling ant. Yeah. Do you pronounce it differently? In ant. Do you pronounce and how do you pronounce the crawly one? Ant. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. We say ant and ant. You say ant and aunt. aunt. You know, everyone thinks like we think they talk funny. She thinks I talk funny. It's it's all just it's just different. It's just the different. are wrong. <laughs> Come on, I'm trying to be all sensitive. Like we're all right, guys. It doesn't matter. I'm not good at being sensitive. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. If, if you if you want a bit of sass, just I, go check out. I Cheryl. think that's a br the British in me, though. Is it? I think so. Are you a little bit rough around the edges? Yeah. I think we're, well, the Americans are more kind of polite mm. and they want to make people feel at ease. And, <laughs> whereas we're, us Brits are just like stiff up a lip, I think. And is it true? Tell it how it is. Hmm. You know, I don't really know any, any English people, so I, I don't really have a lot of experience with that. Do you know any other Americans? Um, I know a load of Canadians, but not really Americans so much. I mean, I know some from. <laughs> in terms of like listening to them speaking mm. and stuff like that, but not personally. Not personally. Yeah. yeah. So those were some words that are pronounced a little bit differently, but now we're gonna say like, I call it one thing and you call it something completely mm -hmm. different. Yeah. So when you apply for a job and you go for the interview mm -hmm. and like you hand them a piece of paper with your qualifications, what do you call that? CV. A CV. Yeah, we say resume. Obviously I understand resume though. You like do. You could. See, yeah. I think most Americans would not understand CV. I mm. think they would be like, what on earth are you talking about? I oh, really? Yeah, I think so. Funny. Yeah. Okay. Oh. Okay, so this that I'm holding in my hand, how do you call it? A mobile phone. Mobile phone. Or a mobile. Phone. Cell phone. We definitely say cell phone. Although I think people refer to them now quite often as the brand name, so it's your iPhone or your Samsung. Or That's so true. That's, That's, That's true. more in the last few years. That's true. Yeah. So when you are out and you can't pay with a credit card and you have to go get money, what do you get it out of? What is that machine called? Cash machine. Cash machine? Or an ATM. Okay, ATM. That, that's what I would say. Yeah. ATM. But that's not so natural to say. What? For me. Cash machine? No, ATM. ATM. Yeah. Uh, okay. So um, over here, like in Europe, the first floor, like I shouldn't say first floor, the fir yeah, the first floor that you walk into in a building, what do you call it? Ground floor. Ground floor, right? Yeah. And then up one is first floor. First floor. Where we call the the one that is on the ground, we call it the first floor. And then the up oh, really? Yeah, you didn't know that. Yeah. 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 Sure. yeah, so like I think is it in all of North America or just US? I think it's most North America. So like the one right on the ground is the first floor and then you go up one side of stairs, you're on the second floor. You never heard of that? No. no. Seriously. So what would the ground floor be? First floor. So ground floor doesn't really exist. Oh it no. It would be no. like the base mm -hmm. basement. No, basement is if it's underground. The cellar. The cellar. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Another <laughs> one. Okay, camera overheated. We had to cool it down for a second, and we decided to bring in a special guest. The Swiss. It's plant based Matt. <laughs> 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 so what are we gonna do for the final part of the video? 
I'm gonna give you a lesson on how to talk. <laughs> well, I say. How to talk? <laughs> okay. That is big words. Yeah, okay. <laughs> no, an English pronunciation yeah. lesson. Okay, all right. Perfect. Leisure activity. Oh, leisure activity. <laughs> say it again. <laughs> Leisure activity. <laughs> She's like a like a like. She, what's the what's that song where Rosetta Stone? Like Siri. <laughs> no. Yeah, yeah. Leisure activity. That was good. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Parliament. 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 <laughs> you said it like like an American. <laughs> Parliament. <laughs> Schedule. 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 Vitamin. <laughs> Vitamin. <laughs> Say it with the accent! <laughs> Didn't I do it? I thought I was doing it! Let me know in the comments down below. <laughs> How is he yeah. doing 1 to 10? Okay. Vitamin. Vase. 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 Privacy. You go first. Privacy. <laughs> Privacy. Okay. Can I have a, a little privacy? <laughs> Just, <laughs> neither of you is saying it right. There you go. Say the whole sentence. Neither of you is saying it right. <laughs> <laughs> Matthias, I know I'm laughing at you. I'm, I'm probably just as bad. We're trying to teach a Swiss to speak English with an English with a accent. accent yeah. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Neither of you are saying it right. No, that was awful. <laughs> what was it was just the what right was then. Right. But how would you say it? <laughs> More neither. More neither of you are saying it right. I have to be more fancy. Neither of you are saying it right. <laughs> that was okay. That was okay. Okay. I'm going to go down this route. I'm going to, to go. <laughs> I'm going to go down this route. I'm going to go down this route. <laughs> was mine good? Yeah. Mine wasn't good. No, it's the exact same. It's the Root. exact same. No. Route. <laughs> Rue, you sound so American. Root. You're so funny. <laughs> Yogurt. Yogurt. <laughs> I can't. I can't answer you with this. <laughs> Yogurt. No, I can't say that. Okay guys, I really hope you enjoyed this video. Don't forget to go check out Cheryl's channel. Again, it's linked down below. Thank you so much for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up and I will see you tomorrow in the next one. Bye! And until next time guys, don't forget every single day you have the opportunity to take your dreams and put them into action. So, work hard, be kind and make it happen. Yeah, that was perfect. Oh.